Hello and welcome to this Nakivo Backup and Replication tutorial. In this video, you'll learn how to create a local backup repository. In the Web UI, click Settings and open the Repositories tab. Here, click Add Backup Repository and select Create New Backup Repository to open the wizard. In the Type tab, choose Local Folder to create a repository in a local folder of the selected transporter and click Next. In the Name and Location tab, enter a name for the repository. Select the assigned transporter and input a path to the local folder where the repository should be located. Click Next. In the Options tab, you can set up storage savings, encryption, reliability, and maintenance options. Next to the Data Size Reduction field, click Settings to select the compression level for backups. Fast compression takes less CPU power and best creates smaller backups. Leave Store Backups in Separate Files option enabled if you intend to create immutable backups. Note that this option has to be disabled if you want to use deduplication. Choose the desired setup and click Apply. Enable encryption if you want the solution to encrypt the repository destination. Note that this option is available only if you create the backup repository locally on a Linux-based machine with an installed assigned transporter. Let's look at reliability and maintenance settings. Enable automatic repository self-healing if you want Nakivo Backup and Replication to automatically check for issues in backup infrastructure and repair them. With this option disabled, you can still run the self-healing process manually. You can also run repository self-healing on schedule to allocate resource-intensive operations to non-working hours. Enable Run Full Data Verification on Schedule to verify all data for consistency with source VMs. Enforce Explicit File System Sync to use a different sync method during backup operations. Explicit Sync is considered more reliable but may cause performance issues on certain storage devices, which is why it is disabled by default. Finally, you can choose the option to detach this repository on schedule if you plan to store the repository on a removable medium. Click Finish and wait for Nakivo Backup and Replication to create a repository. This concludes our how-to video. Visit the Nakivo Resource Library for more how-tos and other useful resources.